Hello everyone, my name is Spring Gamer. Welcome to Star Pound. Uh, so right now I did a few parts on um, Echo. I might as well do one here. Now, I tried seeing if I can get Starbound fatties working, but I couldn't. They're pack files, and they show up, but don't. Trust me, I tried. Oh yeah, I forgot I had... Uh, rising music on. So, oh, there are different keys, and this also is a lot more complex than it looks. Huh? 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 Like, there's a mod. I also have a handful of other mods on as well. So, so J opens up that. Yeah. I can't sprint. Uh, this is my first time ever playing Starbound. I hope you guys understand that. I guess we're starting.
Already starting off off the bag. That was suddenly unexpected, just an attack out of nowhere. We just started. Alright, it's like I have even <laughs> I haven't even gotten past the title intro. Uh, so I chose a, la a black latex beast for fan service. For those who've seen my uh, changed videos. So, I think I kind of prefer swords. Oh, I have a little white latex blob. Ugh. That means we can't go there anymore. Explore the orbited planet. How do I use it? Yes. I guess I'll just stay back down. So if you're wondering, yes, I did add the alert sound. Really? So, it looks like I need to have... 
be completely grounded to beam back up. Might as well place down the crafting table. I'll probably craft the, um, the Urusama and, and obviously the, um, the Raiden's normal high frequency blade as a later as well. I should turn off my Discord overlay. Today, hold on. And I'm gonna mute this. Actually, I can just go to uh, registered games overlay off. I said, I said overlay off. Wait, it says the overlay is off. What? I'm not sure. Actually, I can just that. It's also dark out, so I can't see anything. Like, I could go ahead and craft the stuff. Which... So, they are two-handed weapons, and they craft very fast. Like, how strong are they from the stats screen-wise? Oh, okay, so... Alright, Fox Blade is one of the most powerful weapons in the entire world. Notification stop! 24 hours, mutants. Dude, jeez. Like, I'll have them in my inventory, I'll probably store them in my ship. Yeah, it does seem to require both of them. No, I'll probably use them later. I built torches. So I need need coal, but it's too dark. Only four for any of them? Yeah, you do need both high frequency blades in order to get the Grey Fox blade. Oh, 
There's a good reason why I added that. Like, I can barely see them because all of a sudden the darkness happened. Honestly, I prefer the swords more. I can see why they're easily craftable, you, so you can get them right off the bat. Uh, like, I'm going in this game completely blind. So that, no, that's not missing texture. It's a, a little low on health. Already. We only lose items upon death. Let's see. They only go down in three hits. Oh yeah, I can rest in these to get health. Okay, bye. Perry. Oh, it's like a yeah. I may end up dying. This is not the first time I've died in part one. So I'm guessing most of the creatures are not automatically hostile. Like some like these things here are. down. Oh, it's just medicine. So I can crouch, but I can't go prone. As their fall damage. What's this? Yeah, I still can't see anything. That was just a blind switch. I don't know why the 
combat music isn't playing. Uh, there are enemies there. Dig through here. Okay. Never had that happen. Oh. death. death. Yeah, so... So, yeah, the qu- the frag- core fragments are pretty important. Cause that was not nice. I don't think I've ever heard this track before in Metal Gear. Yeah. I think I'll just use Raiden's weapon. And I'll put it in this slot here. Oh cool, it has a little visual effect. <laughs> Yeah, 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 I think I'm definitely gonna just, so if I do this, oh yeah, it deletes them after a few seconds. I'm just gonna continue using these until I start to actually obtain legit legendaries. Oh, I didn't, I didn't, I can't even.
Why does everything have to be so dark? Find coal, that's really the main thing. Of course, to collect core fragments. I also lost what was in my inventory, so fun. So spears have a nice little benefit of going having a bit more reach and are a bit more controllable from what I've learned. Just try and find Poisoning. Am I gonna die again? Because that would be interesting. No, I'm gonna do this just in case. That's a little storage container. Alright, can I not put this here? stuff already in here that I can utilize. And one of them is also a part of my character. It actually does more damage than my current weapon. So I can just put this here. So did I pick up any just go ahead and just make a plate necessary.
that helps. Now I have easy access to switch to my blade. Like, I might as well just go ahead and make them. Them. Because it requires two of them. And then I can just beam back up, put those in whenever, and then bring them out whenever I need, whatever I, I want. So this one's a lot more, more complex than it looks, by the way. We also need to find core fragments. So this thing does six, nine damage. Oh, and I can do that. better than the broken sword. How effective is this? Oh, it's like... Uh... God, what's his name? Okay. Like, everything deals more damage than I do, but... I can do it a bit more effectively. Oh, hello. I'm not messing with that. Oh yeah, they're not friendly. Oh, I got them. Not sure who those guys were, but they certainly weren't friendly. They certainly weren't friendly. Starbound wiki to see where I can find core fragments at. Starbound core fragments. Oh, I think so. Personal movie 
roughly this will request, of course, there's an ad. Fun! That is not... Okay, so we can't see what these creatures are called. Okay, so I just need to look around for the core fragments of the ground. I just need to look underground. So am I able to do anything with the light source? I also don't know if this is an original remix of one of the tracks in Metal Gear Rising. I've seen or one in a part of the game. I know this is when you're controlling the dwarf geckos. A dwarf gecko. Thank you. 
Yeah, that thing did not last long. Oh, alright, bye. These day and night cycles are fast, by the way. Yeah, it's probably gonna be one of those long games. down here now. I also do have like a handful of other Metal Gear Rising mods, like two of them to be exact. Gemma in, so I'll be right back.
back. Had to also go use the bathroom. Probably hit it through here. Uh. I don't have a med kit. I think I'll just go ahead and set down a sleeping bag. I'll spear you. So knockback doesn't seem to be that high in terms of general combat. So this is where I last fell down and died. I'll probably find the rest of my things too. Hello. Ooh, that is not pretty. If I'm too far underground, I I can't be back up. Oh well, this is my stuff.
Yeah, so most of these creatures aren't immediately hostile. The alert sound is a good indication. Oh, we gotta go up there. Is this a drop? Oh, that's a well. seem to be very much. I might as well beat back up because I'm here. I got achievements. So am I in the Navigation's offline still. So where will this put me at? Alright, there's no need for the action music yet. So you can't get I am very smart, by the way. Thank goodness I'm not on hardcore. This would be very embarrassing if I die before you go off the first planet. 
Thank you, Steam, for making me feel better. Like, I haven't even gotten past this uh, part one, and I'm already dying a bunch. Plus, I need to explore the caves, so I can at least get to where, what I need. Like, how do I know what they look like? That's what I'm confused about. Oh, if there's anything behind you. Can't teleport me back out. Just sleep to heal. Oh, which helps. Helps like it's detecting that it's installed correctly, but I just don't know why it's not showing up. stuff anyways. I might go ahead and head this way. Sleeping out here. Please don't hit me. Why is everything out to kill me? Crud. Head. Head. Everything has killed me about uh once. Let alone it's night time. Oh, 
Oh, that's not nice. So, pixels act as my currency. And these don't do anything. Not nice to me. That 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 could be said about any game. They usually kill me very quickly. The uh, times usually I don't die like in that. But... You see the day and night cycle. Oh, man, is it fast? how the hitboxes work in this game, what counts as a hit and what does not. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, hello. Okay, so where do I find it, though? Oh, it's a campsite. Oh, right here. Flygar from uh, Dig Dug. Oh, I'm poisoned. Oh. I saw the little text that indicates that I did find a new upgrade.
Yeah, so I can use right mouse to throw these. Uh, yeah, I'm not messing with that. I already searched these. Ow. how long I've been recording for. Alright, uh, I'll find the core fragments. Oh, it's a one hand dude.
Uh, one-handed weapons seem to have a bit of a wind-up. Up, though. We almost have enough of core fragments to get a move on. Now I can use my left mouse.
guys. Ow. So going down is not a bad idea as well. It helps me find more of what I'm looking for. Oh, I'm poisoned. Why is it on my right slot? through walls, that's brilliant. Turn back to the surface now. I would be fine. Oh, I picked up another one.
Oh, I got poisoned again. So I clicked. Oh, that's why there's no blocks back here. There uh, technically is. Mod, but uh, it doesn't seem to work. much of it. Anyways, uh, this is all the stuff I have. Oh yeah, it's, uh... How do I get the sword? Inventor's table... Uh, okay, so how do I craft the special sword? Project Deck 42. Ew. Venture table, place it somewhere. Craft an anvil. So just you need a few. Just looking at some of my metal gear, some little add ons. I know you can probably see it, but eh. Anyways, I'm gonna end this one off here. Thanks for watching now. Bye bye.